little brother Orbit. Christmas is coming and we all have loved ones that are with us in a memory. But this Christmas I'm going to hang a memory on my Christmas tree. It will be a butterfly for a boy whose life was taken by the street. There are wars and battles fought for freedom and liberty. And then there are street wars. Young lives are lost in both and families are cheated of their loved ones to travel through the holidays with us. I worked with this boy whose 20 year old life was taken by the street. Long and lean and a boy who I found I could count on for team volunteer work. There were underlying tones of humor expressed by his knowing his first comments of mild resistance in a project was always met with absolute dedication to a completion. A good team player. That is probably why the street liked him so much. When the news came over TV that this boy was shot and killed, it sank my heart. It wasn't fair he was relegated to becoming a memory. Most listeners to the broadcast would not know what was lost. Today I talked to his best friend and we reminisced memories. A best friend who is 17 in the 10th grade is dyslexic and the name of their street is tattooed on his arm. I asked him what he remembered most about his childhood friend. He said every day would greet him with, Hey, little bro, what you getting yourself into today? We agreed. He was someone you could count on. He said the neighborhood called him Bro God. I told him about my dad, a war vet who fought in World War II and how alcohol was often a vet's way of escaping from visions of friends being blown to bits beside them. He looked at me, a soft young face full of empathy and realization and quietly said, I'm a war vet. In the spring, little brother and I are going to plant a memory tree I want that tree to go big and strong, and I want him to bring his children to visit that tree and talk about Big Bro's memories. At least, that is what we talked about today. So this Christmas, I'm hanging this butterfly on my tree for you, Bro God. Keep watching over your little brother. Written for Devon in memory of his big brother.